Hey, what's going on everybody? Freedom Stripes here, and I know this is going to be a little bit of a different video. This isn't Zombies, this isn't Minecraft, this is actually Counter-Strike Global Offense, and I'm going to be telling you guys how to get the... to actually adjust your size of your crosshair, because if you just go on to the default on Counter-Strike, the crosshairs are way too big, I don't like them at all, they get from really big to really small if you go crouch, and it's just not very cool. So I'm going to be telling you guys how to adjust them, to whatever size you would like. Let's get into it. So what you're going to want to do is go down to the link in the description and go actually download this. Actually, no, you don't have to download anything. All you have to do is subscribe to this like website and it's free. It's nothing. You just click the subscribe button. It'll ask you to sign into your Steam. You give them your, your Steam. Then you'll have to go back, click the subscribe button and then it will it will actually send it to your game. So once you get to your game, obviously you see right now I'm just in my inventory. You actually go to play offline with bots. You go to workshop, and then it'll be crashers, crosshair generator, v2. You're just going to want to load that up real quick. Doesn't really matter what the bots are on. And also, I guess I can just go ahead and talk about it right here. Let me know if you guys want to want to see some CS:GO because actually, we just I just got done playing my third ever competitive game, and we we're actually down 14 to nine and came back and won 16 14. It was actually really really cool. You guys might see it on my channel. You might not. I don't know. But yeah, because when I start um, recording Counter-Strike, it gets a little choppy, which is why I don't really like it, obviously. I don't know why. I mean, it's my computer and stuff. But so as you guys can see, let's go ahead and try to connect to the server. Oh, yeah. But this is actually amazing. Like, I freaking love these crosshairs. They're so good. Because when I'm standing, they're the same size, and when I go crouch, they're the same size. It's amazing. At least for me. It will take a little bit to load up. It always does. <clears throat> there we go. So you're going to spawn in to right here. And pretty much all... Oh, th there we go. You pretty much have an hour to do whatever you want. So right here you actually have all the different sizes of crosshairs. Now I, do, I need to remember mine. Mine are actually happy right here. So if you just shoot it, it'll change. So if I want these big green ones, you just shoot it. And now you have these green crosshairs. So here you go, let's go ahead and watch this buy an AK. So you'll stand up and you crouch and nothing changes. The one that I really like is the happy right below this end. You just shoot it and your crosshairs get really, really small. That's what I'm using at the moment, but... Oh yeah, and you also have them on this side too. You want some square small again see this is what I don't like when it's really big and it goes down to really small <laughs> that's what she said and then let's go ahead and pick mine back happy right here all right right over here is actually the color so mine is obviously this light blue and I actually really like it let's say you want a black you just shoot it and now you have a black crosshair orange red well, that's pretty self-explanatory. What the guys? Should I change mine up? Should I just like go like this, just shoot whatever color lands on? Bam! Hey, look, it's green. <laughs> I don't know. I've been liking my light blue lately, so I'm just gonna go ahead and stick with it. What were these like? Even smaller ones? Dang, dude. Dude, this one's even smaller. That's right, I want these. Alright, and then it's gonna come over here, save custom X hair. You just shoot it, it'll save down here in the bottom left. Obviously, you see my name. Uh, that is saved, and then that is actually literally it. You can go into the testing room if you want. These bots, they won't do anything to you. But you can just see how you like it. You can pick the map that you want. So, let's say you want the background of Mirage. Um. Cobblestone. Oh, well, well, I'm just gonna embarrass myself. <sighs> oh, yeah. Can I switch guns right now? Get that one tap going. Oh, wait, I probably can't even shoot him from right here. Get that one tap going. Oh, wait, never mind. Oh, I'm so stupid. Oh, and then they're gonna run. Ah. Uh... Okay. Well. Gotta get that one dig. One dig. 
Oh uh, yeah, so you guys get the drift. So yeah, this is actually how you get to customize your crosshairs. Like I said, there will be a link down in the description to this guy. All you're gonna have to do is click the subscribe button on that website. It honestly will do nothing. But then you just log in your Steam, and then you go, you go to your workshop, and then you will be right here for the liking. And then all you have to do is just quit. Hold on, I have everything right. Yep. And all you have to do is exit to the main menu, and you will have it. If you guys have enjoyed this video, please be sure to click that like button. And if you want to add me on Steam, freedom on underscore stripes, you know, go ahead, come in, add me. Always looking for some people to play with. Uh, I mainly just play CSGO. Uh, so yeah. Oh yeah, dude, look at those two competitive wins. Woo! There it is, dude. 1614. That was the game, yo. Today, 149. Alright. If you guys have enjoyed, please be sure to leave a comment if you want me to post some more CSGO. Leave a like, click the subscribe button. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.